is my pretty girl. Hi. You're walking behind her. Hi. I have to when I do the video. <sighs> Come on, boo-boo. Good girl. Good girl, Ingrid. Come on, baby doll. Hey, everybody. Happy Sunday. This is Amy, 100 plus abandoned dogs of Everglades, Florida. Here is our little update on Ingrid slash Morgan, one of the tent city pups that we rescued, one of the little dogs from Hialeah. What time is it? I don't even know. We've been here for... We've been here for a couple of hours. We are in Delray Beach, Florida. We're celebrating birthdays with our family at Carol's mom, uncle, aunt, and the family are here. Hi, Andrea. She's wearing a shirt because it makes her feel safe. Yes, she's wearing a little t-shirt because it makes her feel safe. It's almost like the thunder shirt effect. Without Stop shaking. She stopped shaking as soon as you put the little shirt on. She was super excited. We got on the floor. Um, for a minute, she was kind of like, who's that? And then she came up, and I got kisses, and Carol got kisses. Hi, Jeremy. Hi, Linda. Hi, Jan. So we're just out. Before we go back into the house with all the chaos, you know how family is, um, we thought that we would start our video outside with a nice little walk. Hi, Stacy. Bonjour, Noel. She's an angel. She's such a good girl. She's doing really great walking on the leash. Still a little skittish, but such an improvement in just a week's time. We dropped her off last Friday. Today's Sunday, so a little bit over a week. <clears throat> She's learning the whole training thing. She had a couple of accidents, which is to be expected. As Carol said, um, you know, the whole world was her toilet they they never she never knew that you know she's never been in a home before she's sniffing the grass I mean it's I can't even put into words to see where we rescued these babies from and then to see them living in in a loving beautiful home with love being catered to and doted on and it's just so rewarding and that's what we want for all of them she peed just what about an hour ago Carol and I took her out about a half an hour ago, and um, Sonny and Cher are great. They're spayed and neutered, and they need a home together or apart. I'd love to keep them together. I love. I would love to keep all of them, be able to, you know, get two at a time because they just love each other. But if there's another dog in the house, that's not necessary. She's so tiny. You're such a little baby girl, Ingrid. This is the calm before the storm when you walk into the house. You looking at the lizard? Look at the lizard. Ooh, look at the big lizard, Ingrid. Sloane's phenomenal, Barbara. She's nothing but love and affectionate and coming out and showing her personality every day. She's so amazing. She's so sweet. Hi, Missouri. Hi, Patty Harris. This is Carol, yes, Carol's mom, her aunt Marie, and her uncle Charlie. They're all brother and sisters, and they all live together. It's actually Aunt Marie's house, and Carol's mom and Uncle Charlie moved in. They're all living together. So let's just say that little Ingrid is the center of their world. Marie, Aunt Marie has come to life. When I, right, Carol, did you notice when we walked in the house, the big smile on her face? Oh, yeah. And she said, we need to order her a new harness. I don't like that harness. It, it's a little sharp. It's just not, you know, the cushy comfort. So I went on Chewy.com with her, and we picked out a new harness, and it's on its way. Carol, and Carol went shopping this morning and picked up um, three or four new shirts for her, and I had one. So we brought her all her new short shirts, and we hung them up in her, her closet. So she has her own wardrobe. <clears throat> She's allowed on every couch, every bed. Oh, that's so good. 
We got poopy. It's right on her own front lawn. It's awesome. Good girl, Ingrid. That's a good poop. Good wow. Girl, mommy. That's a good poopy, Yay. mommy. Do you want me to pick it up for you? I got you it. You sure? Good girl. Yay, Ingrid. You made big poopies. I got a pumpkin star that has a treat for you. You're supposed to have a You get a treat because you made a poopy outside. Yay, Yay Ingrid. No. We get a treat. Let's go get a treat because you're she's smiling. Let's you feel better? Come on. Come on, we gotta tell everybody. Good girl. 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 Good
<laughs> they're knuckleheads. Such. Oh yeah, let's show the. I'm gonna show you. So when we were here last time, they were just in the midst of getting the patio area because they didn't want her near the pool. We were very concerned. Um, so they screened in all of this right here so they can let her out and she can run around and hang out and not have to worry about her out by the fence, even though they put the mesh outside by the pool area. It's a beautiful yard, but at least she has a nice contained area and she's doing walks and they just put a little peepee -pee pad and some, you know, fake grass out here and she's gone out here in the middle of the night quite a few times. So. And everybody else is in the kitchen as usual. Say hi, Cameron. Say hi, Brookie. We're celebrating Book Brookie's birthday today. What are you, 20 what? One? Mm, big 21. Aunt Marion. Say hi, guys. That's my mom, Wilma. And there's Auntie Beverly. And there's Carol's sister, Debbie. Hi. Who's eating the Cheetos? So everybody's eating and talking and we're over here and of course we sit with Ingrid. Come on Ingrid. What is that? You should tell her to come. Good girl, Ingrid. Put a pencil tail with the white tail. Yeah. Yeah. Go get Brooke. Go get Brookie. Come on, Mama. Up, up, up. There you go. Oh, there she is. There's my girl. Hi, Ingrid. Hi. She looks great, doesn't she? Oh, she knocks every single pillow. Here, Mama, what's this? Do you want your pillows? Here. Pillow? Pillow? Uncle Charlie? Do you see how she, look at this. You see how she's come out of her shell and she's, look, there's a, this is the first time. It's normally just Charlie, Aunt Marie, and um, Carol's mom, Roseanne. And now we have all these new people. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, at least seven of us new faces. You know, so there's a lot of new voices and more activity, and she's doing great. She's not hiding. She's actually walking around and curious. She wants to know where everything is. I want to see her do her pillow thing. Yeah, we'll at least expect it then. When she'll do it, not when we're watching. I have pictures of that. You know, we want to see her in action. Hey, These are the pillows. Oh, These are the pillows. Hi, Ingrid. Look how great she looks. She looks amazing. Yes, Uncle Charlie, absolutely. She knows that Uncle Charlie loves her. See? Right on his leg. All curled up. All you have to do is sigh. This dog lays down and goes to sleep. I go. She goes right to sleep? That's she's in she's tune with I, if I'm relaxed she relaxes they pick up on your energy for sure it's great stuff you tie them on see the secret is you take strips of bacon and you rub it on yourself <laughs> and the dog will follow you right off a cliff 
They're yeah. crazy for bacon. Yeah. <laughs> he yeah, rubs take, bacon I, I all over him. I fry bacon and then I smear it all over my clothes and she follows me. He's, they he's, think the dog loves it. Don't believe him, she everybody. He's a jokester. He's a, jokester. <laughs> he he, he's a comedian. <laughs> it's all about the nose. When it comes to dogs, it's all about the nose. <laughs> she says, oh, squirrel went by about two hours ago. Oh. <laughs> so content. Oh, I think a mouse came. Oh, a lizard. I don't like lizards. That was here. There you have it. There you have it. Content. Such content. She's so happy. She's already adopted. She's She's, so happy. she's adopted. There she's she home. She was a human. We could get married. She's a little young. Marie. Marie used to be my baby brother. She used to be my mom's teacher, right? She was never your teacher, right? Oh, thank God, no. Oh, no, I never had the pleasure. <laughs> I never had the pleasure of getting a B for my sister. Oh. Well, how many years of diff- How many years different are you and Charlie? And and ten years? Eleven? Eleven with you and Aunt Marie, and ten with Charlie. And you were you were Roseanne's school teacher. Wow. And she sent me to the deer. And I never was sent to the deer. I was late to class. I was made an example. Who? Hmm. Who? Hmm. They don't care. Hmm. They're talking. That's what they're supposed to do. It's okay. You can hear. Everything's fine. <laughs> Typical family. <laughs> She looks like a little reindeer. You could do a President Johnson. Remember she looks like Johnson a little picture? reindeer. Yeah, Look. Look. President Johnson. Oh, come on. I'm only What's joking. a President Johnson? President Johnson picked up a beagle puppy by the ear. I don't even want to hear it. I, I, I'm just telling you what happened. Are you it's on the news. Oh, he did? Well, we never do that. Yeah, President Johnson. Did. Never knew. Yeah, beagle, beagle dog. I'll never do that. Their ears are very sensitive. Oh, so she's getting used to Get better, so big. She's getting so acclimated. She's she's doing fantastic. Like I said, it's she's been a little bit over a week. Leash. She throws her toys up in the air and plays with her toys and throws the She's got the afro. Who's this one? Who's this? What is this? What is that? Is that a pillow? Looks like a donut. Is that a donut? She's falling asleep. We're keeping her up. That's how relaxed she is. I love you, Mommy. I love you. Yes. We talked about next time bringing uh, one of our dogs over so that she can have a little buddy to run around and play with. She is You guys have... No, not Diamond. No, I'd bring Wilton, our senior. No, she's talking about my dog. Oh, yeah, Diamond, yeah. Diamond would open the door not this one. No, nope. but um, you guys have a walking club here too, right? Where everybody walks their dogs. No. Yeah, there's like some people who well, it's dog friendly community. It was not a formal club. Oh, it's people walking. Walk. It was something we met the same group of people in the morning when CC and I used to walk through there. Oh. The dog is very uptight, very nervous. Very, very nervous, uptight. Dog. Dog nervous very condition. stressed out, yes. Not it's called very to sleep. <laughs> Ingrid, to you sleep. go to sleepy, everybody. We just wanted to bring you in and share our little update on beautiful, what? <laughs> beautiful Ingrid, um, a.k.a. Morgan, one of the tent city dogs that we rescued from Hialeah. Hunter's run. So we're going we're gonna to sign off because we're going to go celebrate with our family. We have birthday cakes and... And uh, we're going to go spend some time with little Ingrid and just chill out. But we wanted to bring you along for the update. She's doing phenomenal. Happy Sunday, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. This is Amy and Carol with our update on Ingrid, a.k.a. Morgan, 100-plus abandoned dogs of Everglades, Florida. It's so rewarding. So rewarding. Can they see the wrinkles on my 